My impression of this first practice was, for whatever reason, the energy level was good. It, it seems like the pace was better. Was this a, a point of emphasis heading into spring? I mean, yeah, it was a point of emphasis, just us moving around, not lacking in energy or anything like that, just really coming out here and trying to compete every day. Yeah. Um, how much time have you been able to spend with, with Graham and, and the offensive coaching staff to, to get an idea of what's ahead for you guys with, with this offense? Well, we had a couple of weeks just going over playbooks and everything like that, just talking to him and trying to get it down, packed and everything like that, just going over it more so with the quarterbacks and just us our, ourselves um, and just trying to get it really down, packed. What's your impression of, 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 of what to expect? Um, um, what I expect, I mean, just quick ball, um, just moving the ball fast and quickly. Uh, mental errors, it shouldn't be any anything like that. We just simple, simple scheme. We just gotta execute. Did you? No, I was just gonna say that you know it, it appears that, that that one of the themes today is simplicity with this new office. You, do you kind of uh, sort of embrace that that uh, idea that it'll be simpler to run? Oh uh, yeah, I mean it's gonna be simpler to run, but uh, but then with that, it's just oh we gotta execute everything like that. So it's just us going at it every day, just repping it, repping it out in a day. So. Right. And with that, how quickly do you do you expect the team to fully embrace this new system? I mean, it shouldn't take, take us that long. I mean, uh, today it looked good. Today, um, just us with the first first day in. So, um, so we're going to see tomorrow on Thursday how, how it picks up. But thank you. Yeah. Do, you, do you see your role on, on, on in, in this offense being any different than it was before? Um, my, role, my role doesn't change. I mean, I just got to get up before the quarterbacks and just really just do my job. Um, just stay, just stay within our lines and everything like that. All right. This is a crazy off season for you guys. Um, what what gives you optimism going forward? I mean, we just got faith in each other. I mean, it's a team bond. Um, we just focus on really on ourselves and trying to develop ourselves and get us ourselves better. What's the difference been like in the receiver room with a lot of guys having left? Have you guys talked about? A different way that things are going to be now? Um, no, nah, we just talk about the season. I mean, we're trying to focus really on spring ball right now. Um, whoever's here, we have been working on. I do, we do miss it, guys. Don't get us wrong. Everything like that. I did affect this time. But, I mean, we're just trying to really focus on the season right here. So, all the people that left, was that something that you guys kind of had in mind going throughout the year? Did you know that some people were thinking of leaving? Or um, we, didn't, we didn't really have an idea until, up until we talked about everything like that and everything. So, us having an idea before, we didn't. What were your first impressions of Coach Harold? Um, he's a he's a real he's a real cool dude. He's he kind of goofy. When I first met him, just talking to me, he just make a couple of jokes and everything like that. Um, but he's a real like chill dude. Watch out! Oh, oh, damn. Wait a minute. That's in the lumber yard. Good, good kick. Man. Yes, coach. Yes, coach. Anyway. <laughs> I mean, that was worth talking to you just for that. <laughs> you ever play any soccer? Uh, no, nah, I played kickball, though. All right. Kickball and punter in high school. You throw the ball like a quarterback, too. Mm-hmm. Baseball. There you go. Okay, uh, Graham Harrell, we, we were able to talk to him. He, he met with us, like, uh, last week, last Monday. I've talked to recruits about him, guys that are, that are coming in. They're not recruits anymore, like Kyle Ford. And I don't know if you guys can talk about him or not, but um, they're all talking about like he's the man. What, what would prompt you know that kind of a reaction when he when he asked what their thoughts are on a guy like Graham Merrill? Um, the the players yeah. saying he's the man, and it seems like the feedback from the guys on the team like you is extremely positive. I mean, because the way he carries himself, I mean, his confidence is really up there. It's not cocky or anything like that or ignorant. It's just really he's trying to put it, put us at a higher level and he's holding us to a higher standard. So, I mean, just him doing that is really just affect us more and trying to do better, not disappoint and do for me. So, really. What have you gotten the sense is going to be different for you personally, as in the routes you have to run or things like that this year? What uh, skills you got to change? First, we got to get used to this grass. <laughs> um, kind of slipping all that throughout the day, but um, just just knowing our depths, everything like that. The depths change. Uh, some of the routes didn't change, so there's not too many mistakes that we're gonna have, and not too many things we got to change with our with our uh, routes when we were running. How different did practice feel? Just in general. Um, it was just a, it was just a little longer because of two hour practice, but I mean, it, no different than any other practice we did. Everything we usually did, just a couple of more stations here and there. Um, but it worked out real good today. Do you feel like you're getting more plays in or more reps during practice? Oh, we're getting, we're getting more live reps, um, which is what I like. Um, we're getting more team reps and everything like that. So it's really, really helping us as offense, I got feel. The 